Hi, and welcome to this week's sports interview. I'm Cam Durr. Today I'm here with track runner Princeton Hall. Thanks for being here, Princeton. Of course, of course. Um, so for starters, how long have you been running track? Um, <clears throat> I've been running track since I was in like fourth grade. I used to go up to like Hershey, Pennsylvania and run against kids and then uh, up to Pennsylvania University to a thing called Penn Relays where kids all over the country and some kids even from Jamaica would come and we do like relays like four by one and then I've been really doing it like AAU travel kind of my whole life so. And what um, are some of the events that you participate in? Um, <clears throat> I've done the 100, 200, 4 by one uh, long jump, triple jump, high jump. Uh, high school I did shot put and discus, but yeah, whatever coach really wants to put me in, I usually do it, so. And you came here to play football from Roanoke. Yeah. Um, and you set a school record in the 60 meter. Um, what made you continue to want to run collegiately? Well, I, I knew I wanted to run when I came here. <clears throat> I just didn't know the coach. The coach didn't know me. Um, but I've had, I had looks coming from high school, from different schools, uh, D2 schools. But I wanted to play football as well. And they were just either track or football. And uh, so I came here. Coach Cam up with the football team set me up with the uh, track coach. Coach Mag, it's my guy. Um, so he kind of set me up with him. And then kind of just started texting him and told me to come out. So I came out and yeah, it just went from there. What is the main difference that you've noticed between like the high school competition and the competition at the collegiate level? High school competition, kids are just really doing it to get in shape for other sports. Like football players would do it to stay in shape for football season. Um, and track is really like my first love. So I was out there with kids that were just doing it for fun, but I was doing it because like I love to do it. So I don't know. And then in, in college, it's everybody's, that's their job. Like that's what they want to do. So it's a, it's a lot more competitive. It's a lot more talking. It's a lot more involved with it than high school, so. So this week you guys will be traveling to Myrtle Beach for the um, Coastal Carolina and the Allen Connie Shamrock yeah. Invitational. What do you expect to uh, do out there? Um, honestly, it's just a good, it's a good chance for us to, to get exposure to what those kids are competing like. Um, I mean, when, you, we, when we go against kids like that, it's just, it's, it's good exposure for us. It's good competition for us because we have really, really good kids here, but we don't know we haven't seen what those kind of kids can run or throw or jump um, until we really get there. So I, I feel like it's going to be really good for us, especially when we come back for ODAX. We'll, we've already seen what that's like. And then so when we come back to ODAX, we can just really crush people. So it'll be fun. Um, what are some of the teams that are going to be out there? Do you know? Um, all I know is a bunch of D1, D2 uh, kids. I don't really pay attention to schools. I don't pay attention to kids. It's just another kid lining up against me. So, so yeah. So in track, um, you are allowed to compete in the uh, with Division One and Division Two yeah. athletes as well. Yeah. Okay. Um, how do you how do you think that the Emory and Henry team will match up against those teams and those guys? Um, like I said before, we have some kids that can really throw. We have some kids that can really run sprints and distance. Um, I mean, it's just any given day, any of us can beat any of them. So it's just that's how I feel about our guys. I'm really confident in our guys. Um, but yeah, any given day we can beat any of them, so. And you said that um, when you'd be getting back, you would, would be competing um, in ODAC, mm -hmm. the conference. Um, so who are some of the teams to beat in the ODAC? Um, right now, really just, Roanoke's a good program. Um, they have a good track up there. I mean, they get to, they get to use it every other day that they want to. Um, they have a good track, so. Roanoke's a good school. Uh, Bridgewater's is a good school. Um, WNL has a good distance team, uh, but yeah, those those two, Roanoke and Bridgewater, they're pretty good. So, okay. and um, what are you looking forward to most this outdoor season? Um, honestly, just having a good time. Really, just tracks just fun for me. So, just having a good time, getting out there and running. That's just just fun. So, that's what I'm looking forward to. Awesome. Well, thanks, Princeton. I appreciate yeah. you being here, yeah. and good luck in Myrtle Beach. Thank you. Thank you. That's all for this week's sports interview. I'm Cam Durr.